Saludos a todos, les habla el Capitán Orlando Muñiz y hoy les estoy trayendo un videito que tiré el martes día antes que empezara la ventolera esta, está pasando el, el, el ciclón este, eh, el in, creo que le dicen, está cogiendo por la parte oeste de la Florida, nosotros aquí no nos va a afectar mucho, creo que va a haber 30, 40 millas, ya pasé por el barco, aseguré la soga, uh, tuve que ajustar un poquito la soga, si tienen barco en el agua, por favor, revísenlo, asegúrense que tengan corriente, que las bombas chicas y las baterías estén bien cargadas y todo esté trabajando. Um, so, con eso hecho, como le dije, el viento empezó ya el martes de la noche, empezó a soplar y ahora va a seguir soplando por varios días, posiblemente ya para el sábado o el domingo se puede volver a salir a pescar. Ahora en este momento no se lo aconsejo. Uh, el martes, que fue el último día que pescamos, tuvimos muy buena pesca. El día comenzó muy bien cogiendo sardinas. La sardina estaba bien, bien bajita, eh, casi a punto de encallar. No, so, hay que tener mucho cuidado cuando entran a buscar la sardina esta entramos como dice, como dice el dicho nos la jugamos porque de verdad que la sardina iba a ser la diferencia entre una buena pesca y una no buena pesca so, decidimos eh, tirarnos y la pudimos coger llenamos los dos viveros teníamos yo creo mil dos mil sardinas no sé ni cuántas y estuvimos jugando fuerte toda la mañana eh, cogimos eh, atunes negros eh, mucho bonito eh, cogimos después tiramos a fondo pescamos uh, el, el yellow eye snapper que le dicen que es el, el paquito de agua profunda de agua amarillo también cogimos con vermilion cogimos chena que le dicen scamp que, que es una de los ojos verdes que se coge en bastante profundidad y otras cosas más pero bueno esa fue la pesca eh, el video lo tomamos con una cámara que estamos probando que es de 360 grados y todavía no, yo por lo menos no, 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 la, no la he comprado todavía, la, esta la trajo Arturo, una cámara que compró y la estamos experimentando con esa cámara, le trajo un video aquí, el video no quedó muy bien en lo que es la posición, eh, todavía tenemos que ajustar algunos ajustes con esa cámara, pero estoy bastante emocionado, voy a estar comprando una, porque es una cámara que tira 360 grados y básicamente todo lo que ocurre en el barco lo capta la cámara, so, se pueden hacer una, una, unas tiradas muy bonitas de las escenas, de lo que está ocurriendo. So, les pienso traer eso pronto. Al final del video, hay algunos videos que tomé con el teléfono que tienen pesca de fondo y cosas así, que ya luce más normal. Uh, no había mucho de eso porque la verdad es que no tuve ni chance de grabar nada. Pero les quise traer esta pesca porque fue buena y hubo bastante acción. Bueno, lo más importante es que por favor no se olviden de darle al botón de like y dejar sus preguntas, sus comentarios, lo que sea. Bueno, vale. My hands wore out. <laughs> oh boy. Keep going deep. Just gotta hold on to her. Yeah, you just gotta hang on and just hope that it doesn't get eaten. Right, right.
there's one underneath you. I'm on the outside. Oh, that's a nice one. Blackfin, blackfin. Here, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, get that one in there. Get Woo! Get you your old blackfin in here. Just open the bell. Here, open the bell, open the bell. There you go. Now lock it back up. Hold this up for a second. You want a picture with him? Nah. No, okay, then let it go. I got you. Might be a black yeah. canard, the one you got on over there. This is a black canard here. Oh! Holy shit. Sorry about that. Big cow? <laughs> Big cow! Jesus. You know me? That's a nice one. That's eatable there, isn't it? We got a few yeah. eatable ones in there. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Uh, so big fish. Let's go. Okay, let's go in, guys. <laughs> you think that's big fish right now? Yeah, big fish right now. Let's go that in. One's, uh, right this time of year, that's tough to beat. In, in the spring, that would be an average fish. This time of year, it's a big fish. How about that? But we'll get them in the spring, we'll get them like up to 30 pounds, sometimes over 30. Somebody caught a 50 pounder this year. That's really unusual. They're, they're fucking just, working, aren't they? Yeah, they're just, they're big. I mean, you just dropped the line in the water and you're on them. He's got a pole up there. Do you want to get it? Oh. Um, take a break. <laughs> <laughs> get him up there, Marky. Oh, oh, look at that shark. God almighty. There's another one here? No. You got a mark? We didn't bring the hard hats. <laughs> you got one up there, Mark. Get it. Storms always good usually. Yeah, but I think the, the fact that it's like weekday, no the weather's worries. good. It's, it's perfect actually for this. I don't like it too calm. The fish get kind of like dormant. Yeah, and they get really difficult. So do we tie this whole thing? I mean, you just gotta let them run. We got uh I got big fish Dave. Captain Mitch over here. You just drop a hey, you drop no you drop a line in the water and they're hitting and they're hitting hard. I mean we've lost uh we got some black fish. 
black fin tuna, right? Early wine. That's what we're got one. Early wine's got one. We need we need you, we need you to go swimming in the water with your relatives. Hey, there's shark right underneath us. Really? Yeah. There's let me one. See it, let me see a fish. Can you see it? Or hold that fish up. Alright, never mind beer, Ben. See, you yeah. got yours. That's this yours. <laughs> And here you go, there's this. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's a big balloon. Uh -huh. there. See it? Oh, you guys are catching us in <laughs> No. Look at his pole. Look at him, he's like a granny over here oh, reeling in. Uh, what well, kind of anything to eat? Yeah, we've time? already got the tuna. You gotta let them take it or you're gonna bust the line. Well, let me see a picture. Hooks running out of hooks. Let me see a picture. He came off or he got eight. Okay. Take it in. Bring it in. Let's see if Frank can, Vince can get one in. He, he can't land them. There we go. Uh, uh, that, one, that one I caught was... Oh, that's a good one. Oh, the shark tried to get it. Right. Yeah, right. Woo! Well, anyway. Anyway. Yeah, oh, we, you know, Williams, we, he tried to negotiate with the girl, she jumped. Oh, yeah, you know. I don't know, you didn't Gotta look too young. Got to be right, got to be. We'll let you go. Open the bell. Sure. Get it, Mitch. I'm gonna get a good look at it. Might, might be able to need. I'm not sure. You need a hook or you got a hook? I got a hook. I just need a bait. No, it matter. Usually I'm a little picky about what bait I put on, but you now I'm just eating it. I think they're taking it all, aren't they? They're in their friends. Just drop it there. Yeah. Find the boat. We might go through every single hook in the boat. At this pace. That one's going to get out hard. Yeah, we got a new hook sponsor. Yeah. It never stayed off. Look at him. Look at him jumping over. All right, you want to give me some bait? Oh, well, yeah, I gave him two. I didn't give you any. No, no. up you're gonna pull that rod out of the rod holder forward okay and then swing it over swing the line over to me there, there it is, is. Get the rod off. nice yeah. right color right color nice fat one big fat one big fat one
Halfway there. Yeah, but it's good. You almost got him off the bottom. Bueno, y ahí lo vieron. Por favor, no se olviden darle al botón del like y dejar sus preguntas y comentarios. Hasta la próxima vez. Mi nombre es Capitán Orlando Muñiz con Normal Fishing.